Welcome back to Echo the Dolphin, and here we are singing to this bird. Yeah, uh, so it's been a few days since I recorded the last video, and I had a heck of a time getting back to this part that I was at, because uh, in Hanging Waters, it does not save your progress. Uh, so basically... If you quit the game and you come back and you try to restart from hang Hanging Waters, it will just uh, take you right all the way back to the beginning of the stage, which is uh, a little inconvenient. So, basically you have to go to the last boss that you defeated and uh, start, the game, start the game from that part and then fight the boss again and... Then it puts you back to where you were in hang Hanging Waters, and then uh, you just, you know, work your way back, and... Yeah, so it took a little while, but... Uh, I don't think I'm going the right way. But yeah, eventually I got here. And... Finding that bird last time was... Not in the cards, so now we found him. And there he is, and he's gonna take us to the last boss. It's just that simple. Really extended cutscene here. sight to behold there. Can I... Oh, I was hoping I could press the sonar button, but it doesn't do anything. <laughs> this cutscene is so long. That's fine, though. I like it. Time to fight the Muta clone. What? Exactly. What exactly? Muta clone is the name of this boss for some reason. And uh, yeah, I read ahead in the FAQ just to have an idea of what to do, but honestly, I have no idea. I don't really remember. Intruder, at last, I knew you would reach me, despite your being everything we believe to be weak and inferior. Racist dolphins. Klansman dolphins. Your success makes me wonder what kind of world you come from and what... Ugh, I missed it. Perhaps a better world. Perhaps not. I cannot risk everything I know for the sake of curiosity. It's very practical dolphin. So, sadly, your brave quest ends here. Alright, well... So be it. Now, okay, air is down here. Where are fish? I need to find fish. Gotta be fish somewhere. He is invulnerable while he's in that shield there. Uh, fish down here as well. There no fish in here? There's gotta be some fish. Like I need to know where they are. There they are. They're good fish too. So basically, yeah, he's sitting up in his little thing here shooting at me, yeah. And Apparently, we need to smash these. 
And when you do so, your controls are reversed. Yeah, so, oh my god, he really shoots at you, doesn't he? Yeah, your controls are reversed for a period of time, so up is down, down is up. And yeah, as you can see, as if it wasn't difficult enough to control. Okay, we need to just wait for it to wear off. Okay, it's worn off. Get some fish. You see how angry he gets when you bash his little eggs down there? So that's two down. Three down. Okay, let's get out of here. I'm the I'm a, one of the people that uh, inverts the y-axis on games, and uh, I just imagine that like when the controls are reversed, there it's for a lot of people it's probably just normal. <laughs> I just it, it, oh my gosh, come on! I guess I don't really need one that bad. Okay, now I do. Yeah, I guess the. I was reading about the inverting of the y-axis for some reason a long time ago and uh, there was some study or something that was like said that if you viewed the controller as being in front of your or, or the controller or I guess your character as being in front of you or if you view the character as being part of you then prefer either inverted or non-inverted axis. It's like, basically, do you tip your head, you know, you tip your head back to look up. So to me, it makes sense to pull back on the stick, but some people, it's just like, you know, I, 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 whatever. I'm just rambling, I guess. It's a one in the morning, and I had to get this recorded, or I would have nothing to post. So, that's all that is. So, the commentary is probably going to be a little crappy right now, but whatever. You know, we're 30 plus videos in, so... What do you expect at this point? This is just kind of a... I don't know, this boss isn't very exciting. I feel like Fire and Ice was the best one. Okay, so I think we blew up, we blew up all of his tubes now. There's eggs or whatever. Let's see if he's out of his shield yet. No, he's not. Okay, so there's still more. Tedious. Okay, I think this is the last one. Is it? Yes. The shield's going down. Oh, oh, I did not mean to swim into it. Okay, I guess the shield's not going down. Or is it? Okay, it's down. Okay, no, okay, yeah, now this part. He has dolphin clones, you know, typical, typical boss style, where they make clones of themselves, and he needs some air, like, pronto. Beautiful, okay. So I gotta kill his fake dolphins, okay. That's one. Stop, stop. Let's 
Let's get some fucking fish first. Fish up here. Yes. It's such a small little reserve. Okay, so he should be chasing me. Yes, he is. Very vigorously. Okay, chase me right in here. Turn around. Okay, and he should be confused now. Is he? No, he's not. He's not. He didn't fall for it. Or did he? It's just, God. Okay, that's one hit. I need some air. How are you supposed to know to do that? I, I don't really know. I guess just because it's glowing, you're supposed to pay attention to it. Okay, come on. Ugh. Oh, controls reversed like that. They're really messing me up. Oh, am I hitting him multiple times here? <laughs> okay, I guess I killed him. That's fine. So that's Mutaclone. None of these bosses were actually too bad. They were all, I mean, they're kind of kind of bland, but they weren't torturous like the crocodile or the crayfish or even the great white. That was kind of rough as well. And there's our there's our piece right there. And now we can get out of Dolphin's Nightmare, finally. Which means we're on to the last section of the game. At long last... Uh, I forget what it's called. <laughs> This cutscene's called Invasion. By returning compassion, compassion and, and wisdom. wisdom, Echo changed history once again. But without the final trait of humility, dolphins and humans were incomplete. Heedless of the danger, they were unready for the foe and destined for defeat. Without the final globe, Earth would become the foe's domain. Scary. Except that his mouth doesn't really close all the way. Chance of reckoning. Yeah, and this is uh, this is as far as I have ever gotten in this game. So after I clear this stage, or actually probably before I clear this stage, um, I will be in uncharted waters for myself. Uh, okay, let me. I forgot what this place is called, actually. I, I am curious. Domain of the enemy. Okay, so yeah. We got a lot of vitalities in Dolphin's Nightmare. Wow. Okay. Without the final trait of humility, Dolphin and Man were unprepared for the Dark Foe. Yeah, they just said that. Seek out your final goal, or else Earth remains an evil's domain. So, yeah, this is this is a pretty dark future here. What's this? Notice there's no music, just kind of loud crashing sound effects, which is very eerie. Air is for the foe queen like water for the fish, protected by the whirlpools, and her minions never rest. 
water reaches new heights, defenseless she becomes, exposing eyes and backbone to your merciless attacks. Reclaim the last gift taken and bring your future back. Yeah, so it's something to do with, there's, yeah, these whirlpools, and, yeah, you see that? That's the, that's the foe queen or whatever. And basically, we have to, oh god, push these rocks into the whirlpools, but doing so with such terrible controls is, you know, less than, okay, back up, thank you. Yeah, we're just gonna ignore all that, and hopefully, okay, there's one down. She's really mad now. Oh, let's take a look at the... Look at that. So... Oh, fucked up future. What's this do? Power of stealth. That might be useful. Okay, she's sending her probe droids out or whatever. Now, I am uncertain if they those things will unclog these. I sure as hell hope not, because that would be... That would be a little unfair. I mean, I'm already battling these controls. Like, you know. Okay, this is not gonna work. Yeah, and they shoot stuff at you. Uh. Let's forget about that one. That one seems pretty heavily guarded. What's this? Power of Vigor. Uh, does that mean I can push these things a little easier? That would be nice. Yeah, I guess it does. Oh, are you serious? Am I going to have to push that all the way around there? You can see why I stopped <laughs> playing this game at this stage, because it's just like, what in the hell? Okay. Okay. It, no, it, it can't go in there. Great. Are you serious? Am I going to have to take that all the way around? And I'm pretty sure you cannot kill those things. They just, I mean, you can kill them, but they just come back. Oh. Yeah, so I hope you like watching me dick around with boulders for... Like, do you see this? Do you see how bad this is? Uh, there's a Vitalit up there, but forget it. Okay, that one wasn't working out either. Oh, man. Did they... Seriously? No. Okay, they didn't. That one's still... Is it, uh, hopefully there's only three of them, because, my god, if there's, like, eight of these things... Then, you know... Like, how are you supposed to... This is so bad. It'd be one thing if it wasn't like all this different terrain and stuff, but the boulder fucking moves everywhere. And I'm about to be dead. Let's get this thing again. I needed that. This 
snap. Stop. Do you see how much damage that took? Oh my goodness, that killed my power of endurance. Uh, that's a bad fish for some reason. Oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, this is gonna have to wait till next time. See you, uh, maybe. Bye. <laughs>